The F-15 Eagle is a multi-role fighter aircraft that has long been the backbone of the United States Air Force. Designed by McDonnell Douglas and first flying in 1972, the F-15 has been in service for more than four decades and continues to be one of the most effective fighter aircraft in the world. In addition to its capabilities in air combat, the F-15 is also known for its ability to carry a variety of bombs and other weapons, making it a highly versatile platform for a variety of missions. The process of preparing a fighter aircraft, such as the F-15 Eagle for combat missions is a very complex task and requires coordination and expertise from many parties. One of the important stages in this preparation is loading bombs and other weapons onto the aircraft. This time we will discuss how the F-15 bomb loading process works, including the role of the ground crew, the steps taken, and the challenges faced. Role of the ground crew. The ground crew is a vital component of military aviation operations. They are responsible for ensuring that all equipment and weapons on the aircraft are functioning properly and ready for use. The role of the ground crew includes bomb preparation. Before bombs are loaded onto the aircraft, they must be carefully inspected and prepared. This includes installing guidance kits, checking stabilizing systems, and ensuring that all bomb components are in good condition. Transport. Bombs are usually transported from storage to the aircraft using special vehicles designed to safely transport explosives. Bomb loading. This process involves attaching the bomb to hardpoints on the aircraft. Ground crews use lifting aids and other devices to ensure the bomb is safely and correctly installed. Bomb loading steps. Before the bomb is lifted onto the aircraft, the ground crew performs a safety check to ensure that the loading area is free of hazardous materials and other potential risks. The bomb is thoroughly inspected to ensure that everything is in working order. The crew also ensures that all guidance kits and additional components are properly installed. The bomb is carried onto the aircraft and placed under its designated hardpoints. Ground crews use lifting aids to lift the bomb into position and then secure it using special brackets and clamps. Once the bomb is installed, the crew performs a final check to ensure that all connections are secure and the bomb is ready to use. This includes checking the electrical connections and guidance system. Pilots prepare to board F-15 fighter jets, procedures, and preparation. Becoming an F-15 Eagle fighter jet pilot is a task that requires very intensive physical and mental preparation. Each mission demands perfect readiness, both technically and psychologically. Steps taken by F-15 pilots in their preparation before boarding a fighter jet, including pre-flight checks, personal preparation, and coordination with ground crew. Pilot personal preparation, health and fitness. Before each flight, pilots must ensure that they are in optimal physical and mental condition. Pilots must also undergo routine medical checks to ensure they are fit to fly. 
Mission Briefing Before boarding the aircraft, pilots attend a mission briefing along with other team members. This briefing includes information about mission objectives, weather conditions, flight routes, target identification, and emergency procedures. Flight Equipment Pilots must check and don their flight equipment, including helmets, oxygen masks, flight suits, and anti gu vests. Pre-flight inspection. Walk around. The pilot performs an exterior inspection of the aircraft, known as a walk around. This involves a visual inspection of the aircraft's structure, wings, landing gear, and installed weapons, cabin, and instruments. After the walk around, The pilot enters the cockpit and checks all of the aircraft's instruments and systems. This includes navigation systems, communications, flight controls, and weapons. The pilot ensures that all systems are functioning properly and are ready for the mission. Communication with ground crew the pilot coordinates with the ground crew to ensure that all technical preparations are complete. After all checks are complete, the pilot boards the aircraft and enters the cockpit. They ensure that all of their equipment is properly installed and comfortable. The pilot turns on the aircraft systems and warms up the engines and ensures that all operational parameters are within established limits. The pilot communicates with the control tower to obtain takeoff clearance. They coordinate the taxiing route to the runway and ensure that all safety procedures are followed. After obtaining clearance, the pilot taxes the aircraft to the runway and begins the takeoff process. Takeoff is one of the most critical phases in the flight of the F-15 Eagle fighter jet. This process requires precise coordination, technical precision, and high mental readiness from the pilot. Before starting the takeoff, the pilot performs a final check of all the aircraft systems. This includes the flight control system, navigation system, communications, and weapons. The pilot ensures that all systems are functioning properly and in optimal condition. The pilot sets and calibrates the instruments in the cockpit, including the altimeter, airspeed indicator, and guidance system. The pilot communicates with the control tower to obtain takeoff clearance. They inform the tower about the status of the aircraft and receive instructions regarding the taxiing route to the runway. After obtaining clearance, the pilot begins the taxiing process to the runway. They follow the designated path and coordinate with the ground crew and the control tower to ensure the safety and smoothness of this process. The pilot brings the aircraft to the designated takeoff position and waits for final clearance from the control tower. After obtaining takeoff clearance, the pilot increases engine thrust by moving the throttle to the full position. Once takeoff speed is reached, usually around 150 to 180 knots, the pilot pulls the control stick back to lift the nose of the aircraft off the ground. Once the aircraft is airborne, the pilot continues to climb to the desired altitude. They adjust the climb angle and speed to reach cruising altitude safely and efficiently. Throughout the entire takeoff process, 
communication with the control tower is essential. Pilots receive instructions and information from the tower to ensure that they are following the proper procedures and maintaining flight safety. Pilots use guidance and navigation systems to ensure that they stay on the designated route and reach the desired altitude accurately. Takeoff is a challenging phase because it requires high precision and coordination. Pilots must be prepared to deal with various emergency situations, such as engine failure or other technical problems. The takeoff process of an F-15 fighter jet is a complex task that requires excellent preparation and coordination. From system checks to communication with the control tower, every step is designed to ensure the safety and success of the mission. With high skill and precision, F-15 pilots can face challenges and carry out their duties with high efficiency and effectiveness.